My name is Edna Adam Ismail. I'm a nurse, I'm a midwife by profession, and I'm here to talk about healthcare, healthcare in my country, Somaliland, talk about women's health, talk about women's empowerment in their lives, and the importance of education for women. Because it is, to my opinion, the education that was given to me that has helped me to help other women. Uh, a woman who says that she wants to build a hospital, uh, governments build hospitals, individuals don't, not in our community. And so they found this a bit strange and very unsure about my, uh, uh, my intentions. It's built on land that was, that was once an execution ground, it was once a military parade ground. So, yes, there, there was some doubt. There was some insecurity about it, uh, about my uh, about my intentions. But we've overcome that. The hospital now has been working for ten years. It's it's the biggest maternal family hospital. We've delivered thousands of babies. We've done thousands of operations. We treat both men and women. And uh, it's uh, today I live on the blessings of, of of my patients and their families. When you have the intention to do something and you know in your heart that this is the right thing to do, you don't stop. You, you just go ahead and do it and you'll find your way to get it done. And eventually people will come around and, and see things your way. The harder the objections, the harder you have to try. You don't mm -hmm. throw in the towel and say, well, there's a lot of objections and why, why am I wasting my time? Why would I waste my resources? But you don't do that. Because if you do, then there would be a lot of women and a lot of children who would be needing help and who would be deprived of that help and that treatment and the care that they need. I feel that, uh, yes, there was the material support. There was, the, you know, I did donate and, and, and build a hospital. But what I get from it today is, is far bigger and far more uh, valuable than what I have given. So, uh, to me, one life saved is, is bigger than, than any bank can hold. Uh, not only am I happy that I've done it, but then I'm also happy to see others also taking up a similar challenge and building hospitals elsewhere and schools and, 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 and other voluntary or charitable or, or, or community development activities. So it has become that small proverbial fish that is attracting bigger fish and, 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 and more people to take part in self-help and community development activities. But there's a long way to go. There's still uh, so much more that needs to be done. Because at the end of the day, we are a big global village. And the, the needs of, of women are the same everywhere. And that's what I'm here to do.